Hello, I'm Bjorn, Movie Archaeologist, and welcome back to the Temple of Movie Reviews. I've got a, a nice little artifact I've discovered. It's, oh my god, it's Alien Romulus. Whoa, new Alien movie. Who knew that was coming out? I didn't. I'm going to throw this now. Really impressive special effect. My god, there it went. Alright, uh, yeah, Alien Romulus. I don't really have too much to say about this one because I think it's pretty good. There are now three, three and a half Alien movies I like. The first one... The second one, this one, and then I, I kind of like Prometheus, like parts of Prometheus. The rest of them I'm not a huge fan of. Um, this one kind of goes back to basics. It feels like a sort of love child between um, Alien 1 and uh, Alien 2. And then Prometheus is kind of there and he's, he's in the corner and maybe a little bit of him got in there near the end. There's some ideas here that are new to the franchise, but mostly this goes back to basics, and it works. People in a uh, isolated space station. My god, there's aliens. They're slowly getting picked off one by one. There's some interesting character development, um, and some, I actually like a lot of the characters in this movie, for the most part. I think they're mostly strong. Um, I would say they're above average compared to the more recent horror movie characters outside of television. Um, I'd say they're pretty good. Specifically the robot guy. I really liked him. I think his, his name was Andy. I'm a fan of the robot. I like robots. Um, I think the movie has some good gore. There's some good scares. There's some cool visuals. Some good action set pieces. Specifically one action set piece involving acid that I won't spoil. That was just very creative. I liked a lot of what they did. The Honestly, the visuals are amazing. It looks gorgeous. They seem to do a lot of stuff practically. I noticed a lot of practical effects that all looked really good. And you could tell they were practical because they didn't look like terrible CGI, which is, you know, awesome. And they when they did use CGI, because obviously the sci-fi movie, it looks pretty good for the most part. I have no complaints on the visuals department. Um, I, I think a lot of the movie is pretty good. I think it's a good mix of action and horror. Um... It reminds me a lot of Alien Isolation, actually. Uh, most of the setting, I think. Uh, but overall, I liked a lot of what they did. The one final thing I want to touch on that I liked is that they um, sort of give you a little peek at what life is like in this world outside of being in a spaceship that's getting actively murdered by aliens. Uh, it's brief, but it's cool. I like seeing that. It's very um, uh, cyber apocalypse and I, I vibed with that. So yeah, overall, Alien I uh Not Alien Isolation. Um, Alien Romulus. I'm going to give like an 8 out of 10. Uh, this is a mostly solid action movie. This might be actually closer to like a 7.5. It's pretty good. I like it. It's not breaking new ground. It's it's entertaining. It's got some creepy moments, some unsettling visuals. does enough that's new and interesting to keep the franchise from being stale while also staying true enough to the original one and not getting bogged down in the sort of gobbledygook that a lot of Prometheus did. Um, which allows it to veer closer to the originals. I think overall, if you're a fan of the Alien franchise, you'll probably enjoy this. I was a fan. All right, uh, like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. Uh, I'm going to go look for more artifacts or something. I'll see you on the next one.